If you have some special custom styles that you find especially useful, and they're not available in a specific document you're working on, say, a document you've received from someone else, you may think you need to recreate those styles within your document in progress. Not true. You can copy styles from one document to another using the Styles Organizer. First, open both the source document, i.e. the document you want to copy styles from, and the target document, i.e. the document you want to copy styles to. In this example, I've got two documents open. A new brief that I've started, document 4, based on my legal brief template, and a blank document based on my normal template. My normal template has some paragraph numbering and other styles I'd like to use in my brief, but my brief template doesn't have those. So I'm going to copy those from the document based on the normal template into my new brief that's based on my legal brief template. First, on the Home tab, click the small launcher arrow in the lower right-hand corner of the Styles Gallery. That will bring up the Styles pane. Click the Manage Styles button at the bottom. It looks like a capital A with a check mark next to it. That will take you to the Manage Styles dialog box. Click the Import Export button at the lower left. Now you'll be in the Styles Organizer. If you have your source and target documents open, you'll see the list of styles available in each on the left and right. If you have other documents open as well, you may need to use the drop down under Styles Available In to get the right source and target documents in place. In this case, I want my brief to have two of my list styles for auto numbering paragraphs plus my block quote style. Copying the styles from the source to the target couldn't be easier. Just select the styles in the source documents list, then click copy to copy them to the other document. By the way, it doesn't matter whether the source document is on the left or on the right. Once you select one or more styles in either document, the copy button will change to indicate which way the copy operation will go. If any of the styles you've chosen in the source document have the same name as a style in the target document, Word will warn you and ask if you want to replace the target style with the source's style. Once you've finished copying the styles, you'll see them in the target document's style list, as illustrated here. If you're finished, click Close to close this dialog box and return to your document. After you return to your document, you may see one or more of your copied styles in the Styles Gallery, depending on whether that style is set to show there. If you copied list styles, you should see those when you click on the Multi-Level List button on the Home tab. Want a printable illustrated version of this tutorial? Click the image on the right for my concise two-page guide to copying styles from one document to another.